The Queen with a Champion Chase is next. This is a two mile grade one, of course. It's the prestige event for the speedsters over the big obstacles, isn't it? Two miles grade one at the top. Fonmort, David Hooley, Honoured Benny, Daniel French, I am Maximus, Paul Rhodes, Kuiping, Kojak, Vinnie Gerard, King of Points, Darren Thompson, Aussie Putra, David Robertson, the King, Joshua Sutherland, One Lip, Darren Thompson, Alien Invasion, Leo Van Rensburg, Fabulous Prospect, David Hooley, Lestinia Stalina, Craig Beckwith, Mandrake, Root, Martin Leadham, Matisse de Barwi, David Robertson, and the Smiler, for Joshua Sutherland, so 14 of the men, and away they go, and some top-notch speedsters in this, and Lacinia Stellina is going to be the one to lead them into the first. Over the first they go, and we've lost one already there, the Smiler's gone, so that's one of the favourites down at the first, and what a nightmare start to the festival for Joshua Sutherland, he's had some really fancied runners so far, and I think that he thought that one was the best of his two in this, he's still got the king, but the Smiler... On characteristic fall at the very first fence. So the senior Stellina then is in the lead, and it's certainly been an action packed day so far. And the senior Stellina comes into the third with a clear lead. From in second place, Matisse de Barwe. Then comes King of Points in third as they get to the fourth, which they're all safely over, although David Hooley's fabulous prospect didn't look a very fabulous prospect at that one and very nearly parted company with the pilot so swinging out then uphill and out for another circuit of the track the senior Stellina is making sure that they know they're in a speed race this time as they get over that one the senior Stellina might be eight lengths clear now of in second place king of points then Batiste de Barbie and Aussie Putra the king is next then one lip alien invasion is after that honoured Benny on the inside in the yellow and white on the outside is um, David Hooley's Fonmort Mandrake Root is next as they get over the sixth and they're all safely over that one with Kai Ping Kojak just the back marker with the lead on this Lucinia Stellina has now been cut right back to a little more than two as they race to the water. So over the water they go. Lucinia Stellina landed in the lead. I am Maximus has moved through in a second. Aussie Puchers third. Then Matisse de Barwe and then one lip and then the king and then king of points. Then honoured Benny on the inside. Fonmort on the outside as they take that ditch. The leader was slow over that one and they're queuing up behind now. Then the king has moved into second. David Rawson's pair of looming behind that one as they get to the next and over that one it was La Cinea Stellina that still led but only by about a neck to Matisse de Barwe in second. The king is between the two of them. Then comes Aussie Putra and Iron Maximus and then King of Points. Then after that one comes One Lip. Kuiping Kojak's creeping through the inside and is getting considerably closer. Over this ditch they go and there's a faller at the back there. Fonmort's gone. So Fonmort's out of it and it's Lucinia Stellina in the lead then from the David Robertson pair. Aussie Putra on the inside. Matisse de Barwe on the outside. Between those two is the King. Then comes King of Points who looks to be going well. Iron Maximus is next. One Lip is running on. Honoured Benny and Alien Invasion the next. Then Kuiping Kobach Jack then Mandrake Root and finally Fabulous Prospect they've got three more fences to take and the lead of the Sinister Stelina lands in the lead as a faller at the back Kuiping Kojak has gone it's Lucinia Stelina by two still kicking on again now this leader King of Points is second Iron Maximus is third then Alien Invasion Matisse de Barwe is next the King is beginning to struggle on it Benny is trying to swing round the outside they're coming out towards the home straight then now they've still got two to take in the champion chase and it's Lucinia Stellina in the lead. Alien Invasion in second. Look at this honoured Benny coming through with a run now. And they get to the second last. Over it they go. Lucinia Stellina landed in the lead. Here comes Honoured Benny. Honoured Benny takes it up. He's Honoured Benny over the last one. He nearly went. Lucinia Stellina still there in second. Matisse de Barwe is running on. So too is Aussie Putra. He's Honoured Benny in front. But now Matisse de Barwe is beginning to assert. And Matisse de Barwe is going to take it. He's going to be another one for David Robertson. Up towards the line. Matisse de Barwe is going to win the Queen with a champion chase. Honoured Benny in second. Aussie Putra third and the city is clear and the invasion of the king and I am Maximus and one lip and all the way back to Mandrake Root king of points went at the last and David Robertson well he said in the preview show that he always comes good at Cheltenham and he's, that's his second winner today I think Matisse de Barwe for David Robertson takes it honoured Benny for Daniel French for a big race in second Aussie Puger for David Robertson again was third Lucinia Stellina for Craig Beck with a brave run from the front horn for fourth and Alien Invasion for Leon van Rensburg was fifth but there will be questions asked in the Joshua Sutherland camp about what has happened to them on day one of the Cheltenham Festival because they came into this with two or three red hot favourites and they've really struggled and the Smiler a surprise odds on favourite faller at the very first fence.